Business Lexington is made possible by the Keeneland Association, offering the finest in thoroughbred racing each April and October along with auctions four times yearly in Lexington, Kentucky. By the law firm of Bowles Rice. By Smiley Pete Publishing, Lexington's community media company at smileypete.com. Now, your monthly 30-minute local business news resource, Business Lexington, with your editor-in-chief, Tom Martin. Business Lexington feature reporters, Eric Carlson, Lisa Davidson, Chris Huskison, and Doug Hyde. With commentary by Sylvia Lovely. This is your partner in progress. This is Business Lexington. Welcome to this special edition of Business Lexington. We wanted to highlight for you some of the stories we've been covering in 2008. I'll talk with entrepreneur, angel investor, professional venture capitalist, and filmmaker Bob Compton about his documentary, Two Million Minutes. It's a comparison of the high school academic experiences and achievements of two students each in the U.S., China, and India. In today's economic conditions, many businesses are looking for new ways to attract customers and then to keep them coming back. Lisa Davidson looks into a new partnership between the U.S. Postal Service and independent retailers and shop owners. Lexington businesses are getting involved in the arts in a big way. Chris Huskison looks at some high-profile examples of business-supported public art. Eric Carlson focuses on what's at stake in the development debate, Fayette County's factory floor, our dwindling agricultural land and green space. But first, Doug High takes us to Lexington's Manchester Street, a neglected corner near downtown with a history that may now determine its future. 